to Jake Paul. He's refusing drug testing. Welcome back, guys. Make sure to like, sub, and comment, and let's get right into the video. Tommy Fury's uh, dad, uh, Big John Fury, did an interview in which he stated um, all kinds of stuff in the contract. You've got to do this, and you've got to do that. I could go into it more and more, but I don't want to bore people with the politics. They wouldn't sign up to the VADA testing as well. That bothered me a little bit because I wanted that in the contract. Now, Jake Paul has had a weird history with drug testing and with, you know, commissions and all that stuff. Because if you remember back in the Woodley fight, many people accused Jake of taking PEDs and Tyron Woodley even said this in their face to face. Now, Paul took part in drug testing for his last fight, but it was on behalf of the Ohio Athletic Commission, not the recognized Voluntary Anti-Doping Association. Jake's um, results came back negative. Um, now, I, I don't know if he's using PEDs or not. I, I know that he's had bad acne going back to his YouTube days. Um, don't ask me why I know that. I just do. But um, I do know that that has been something that's not, not just related to PEDs. Now, why is he not uh, requesting VEDs? Well, he might try and do something similar when he's in Miami and do it on behalf of the Miami Athletic Commission. And he might try doing it... Um, not using VADA, I'm not sure if you can, I, I, I'm pretty sure that you can do testing through stuff that's on the VADA, but, you know, Deontay Wilder, Canelo, I mean, every boxer pretty much uses this, so I am gonna be suspect and be like, hmm, but I, I just don't know why he would want the, to not get tested, to not sign up for VADA v -A -D -A testing, it's a little suspect, and I have to raise my eyebrows, um, because, you know, th th this is the kind of stuff that we don't want to see, right? And it could lead to the fact is, does Jake Paul cheat in his fights and does he use performing enhancing PEDs? Maybe, maybe. Now, Jake might come out and say, oh, this and that, and he might try and make some kind of convoluted excuse, but I think we should stay on Jake and we should really question why has he not signed up for VADA testing because that is very concerning and, um, you know, I, I, I don't know why he would even need that because, I mean, he's beaten not so many people. So, I, again, I don't know. And this is a, 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 a groundbreaking, breaking news alert story. Um, and, yeah, man, I just I hope that Jake plays fair and that he's not going down this path because... You know, I did defend Jake and said that none of his fights were rigged or staged, but could he have been using performance enhancing for some of them? I mean, since the controversy, maybe the t the Tyron Woodley fight, but um, I, I'm not 100% sure on that one. But anyways, guys, that's the video. Um, and let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Peace.